everybody, welcome to our channel, Homeschool Honey. In this video, we're gonna be sharing the different ways you can show the rock cycle with different starbursts. Make sure to go down there and hit the subscribe button and the like, and make sure to check out some of our other um, homeschooling videos, including some other ones about the rock cycle, and we'll talk to you later. Thanks, guys. Oh, mixy, mixy, so you've got them all mixed up, right? Sort of. Sort of. What kind of rock are we making? Seven. Sedimentary rock, and now we've got to glue them together. So start. Gl wait, glue? Not glue them, but like push them together to make a rock. I'll try. That's okay. Can I like pick it up? And yeah, yeah, pick it up. I'll try. <laughs> you can do yeah. it. So pick it up and try to make it into one rock. Now it's got all these different rocks. The sediments are all together. You yeah, I wish it was that, <laughs> but it is. Don't eat it. Can I take a nibble? Nope. Don't eat it. I haven't. Didn't have you wash your hands. <laughs> Oh. That's why we have extras here, so you'll be able to eat those. <laughs> All right, show me your sedimentary rocks. Ta -da. How do sedimentary rocks form? Look at this gumball. Like, do they like get pushed together from other rocks? They're like layers, like uh -huh. the sediment that might deposit in a uh, like it might be like stream. A, could be like a stone, and then sand just comes in and it goes on top of it, and another stone. Yeah, it could be anything. Yeah, it just layers up and layers up and it all mixes up, right? Okay, so we are gonna take our sedimentary rock and we are gonna apply more pressure and heat. The heat's gonna come from our bodies. And we're gonna make it, if we're, if we're making a rock with heat and pressure, what kind of rock is that? Metamorphic. Metamorphic. Igneous rocks are totally melted and cooled. So have we totally melted these? Nope. I got a pot of boiling water over there that we're gonna melt these in. Do you guys like So we are gonna apply heat and pressure. You gotta use lots of pressure and then the heat from your body. <laughs> Get your body heat on there. Like I'm holding mine in my oh, fist okay. and warm it up. No, 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 you do it your way. So you can do warm I have it to up. Like, does it have to be flat? No, it can be warmed up flat. I have mine just curled up in my hand, warming it up, trying to get it softer. Now, are metamorphic rocks totally melted? No. No, which rocks are totally melted? Um, igneous. Igneous. I'm gonna take mine out of the bag and just... Okay, what kind of rock are we making? Metamorphic. Metamorphic. Metamorphic rocks form how? Being smooshed. Yes, yeah, smooshed and heat and heat. pressure. So. We're using the heat from our hands. our hands and our body. Okay. So we can see. We can't see those specific little bits anymore. They're all smooshed together, huh? Yeah. So they're all kind of swirled together. Hmm. All right, when you're done with your metamorphic. Make them into a ball? No, you don't have to. You can have it flat. You can have, like his is flat. I have a question. Mine is like a ball. You don't have to make it a ball. Like when we dip it into the um, hot, um, the the boiling water, can I have? Can I do this? Can I like put tongs? In? Oh, you'll see. Wait, what tongs? You'll see what we do. All right, put yours down so I can see how they turned out. Or maybe I did an egg thing. Like, yeah, that would be too hard. Let's see how they turn out. All right, these are what? These are our metamorphic rocks. See how they're all swirled together? Woo! We don't see our specific different kinds all separated out? No, but this one's just right in there. Right? <laughs> that's okay, that's okay. Yeah, they're smooshy. Right? All right, let's talk about igneous. What happens with igneous rocks? They are... Uh, heated, heat, boiled. Yeah, melted, and then they cool. You drop it in? Sure. So we have got some very hot conditions here. We are putting our rocks into... Come on, Tons is a bad idea. <laughs> I'm gonna drop mine in. Okay, make sure it goes into the... Don't make a splash, please. No, don't splash, because it'll burn you. Okay, then we're gonna wait. Wait, is there any water in those cups? We don't need the water. It can ha I mean, it could be in the water, but we just need the heat. So we're gonna watch and see. What happens? What happens to our igneous rocks when they it's heat all up? Hot, we get a bottle of water. And... Okay, scoot back a bit. Cause it's still it's right. <laughs> I have a question, Mama. Okay. Before we like take it out, like do we like take it out, put put it in like some water? I'll take it out. Cause with igneous rocks, they they get heated up, 
and then they cool. Like we just leave them? You just leave them. Oh, I thought we could. Why don't we just put them in cold water? I mean, you could. Don't they get flattened? Be careful. So I have the heat back on. Bubbles. I know we can't. I'm using canning tongs to get these out. Stay back. Okay. Uh-huh. Got a little bit of water in there. Who's this who's? Who's this who's? I don't know. Mine had water in it. Okay, well when it cools off, we'll peel them out, okay? Yeah. Sound good, Michael? Mm -hmm. Thanks so much for checking out our video everybody make sure when you're using that hot water you have got adult supervision and i hope you enjoyed this video let us know if you try this out and if you had some different results and we will talk to you later bye everybody mm -hmm.